In this Substance Painter tutorial for beginners, I will show you how I texture a realistic game asset in Substance Painter. The link to download Substance Painter is in the description. I start by importing the low poly crate model. I'll be using the Unreal Engine template with a 2K resolution. I click on select and open the low poly FBX file and then click on OK. Now I need to bake the maps. Under the texture set settings, I scroll down to the mesh maps. And click on bake mesh maps. In the baking window, I uncheck ID since I won't be baking this map for this project. And I also uncheck normal since I'll be baking that later. I will use the 2K for the resolution and click on bake selected textures. Now I'll start working with the layers. I search for wood on the shelf and I add the wood chip hull old to the layer stack. I open up the material folder. I choose the gradient for the base color. And I want to make this base color a bit darker. So I change both colors of the gradient. I also want to make the secondary color a bit darker. I choose the HSL perceptive for the secondary color and change the lightness and the saturation. To make the edges more defined, I select the HSL perceptive for the edges and I change the lightness. I've now taken a stock wooden texture and made it my own. Now I can move on to adding some height information on the crate. Under alphas, I search for square, uses my brush. I'll add a fill layer to the top of the stack. And I'll turn off all the channels except for color and height. I'll change the base color to a dark gray. And change the height to negative one since I want this to dig into the mesh. I zoom into the UV unwrap I add a black mask with the mask selected I click at the start of my line and then I hold down shift and I select the end point and click a second time. And this draws a line across the selected face. Then I repeat this process on the other five sides of the crate. Now it's time to add some nails to the crate. 
I add a second fill layer and I import an alpha that I downloaded from Pixelogic. This is the Industrial 44 by Ryan Taylor. The link is in the description. Set the color to a dark gray. The last thing I need to do is bake the normal map. Choose File and Export Textures. And I'm going to choose the normal and AO map. With no alpha for the template. Then click on export. After all the maps are exported, I drag and drop the normal map onto the shelf under the textures. I change undefined to texture and choose my import preferences. I then find the normal that I uploaded and I drag it onto the normal slot for the baked textures. I'm then ready to export the maps and use them in another 3D package. If you found this useful, please subscribe and turn on notifications. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.